We are on Tonquin Beach, right beside Tofino, beautiful part of British Columbia, but in an area that's actually got a high risk um, for tsunami, should there be a major earthquake. So we're here today with about 80 kids from the local elementary school, and we're gonna do what we're calling the first ever high ground hike. And that's to give kids the uh, muscle memory so that they know, should they hear a tsunami alarm or alert, that they need to head to high grounds. I think, yeah, there's been a bit of practicing of practicing going on, and certainly all the community members here were very familiar with this particular trail, but to actually think about what it would be like in the event of a tsunami or a, an emergency where we have to evacuate the beaches is an important thing. We face a significant earthquake risk here on Canada's west coast. The science tells us there's a 30% chance of a major earthquake striking the region within the next 50 years. And while we've made some significant strides in terms of improving our preparedness, there's always more to be done. And that's why events like today are so important. We do have a lot of earthquakes in southwest BC. Uh, the one that most people are concerned about is the big one or the subduction zone event. Um, that one would cause a tsunami. Um, as well as that though, there are crustal earthquakes that happen every day and can be damaging as well. Tofino and other coastal communities uh, need to be reminded annually and frankly every month if, if possible that there could be a tsunami and they know what to do. So that includes not just getting to higher ground, but it also includes having an emergency kit. So I'd, I'd encourage you to follow on Twitter at PreparedBC or go to the PreparedBC website and check out what things you should have in your emergency kit at home and at work.